Hey, it's your boy Stuart Scott coming at you live from Sports Center. And Neil Everett. Before our scheduled programming, we have breaking news. Heather Sue Mercer is filing a Title IX lawsuit against Duke University. For those who don't know what Title IX is, it is an act to ensure women's equality in sports. Duke's former head coach, Fred Goldsmith, told Heather Sue Mercer, former All-State kicker at Yorktown Heights, that she had made the team. She was a walk-on kicker in 90. She was in an inter-squad scrimmage and kicked the game-winning 28-yard field goal, as you see in this video here. After the field goal, she got instant media attention, with numerous interviews appearing on The Tonight Show. Even with all the media coverage, she still did not play a single game in 95, but was still on the full-time roster. Goldsmith told Mercer not to participate in any summer activities and refused to give her a uniform. Goldsmith stated, I'm wondering why she did not prefer to participate in a beauty pageant rather than a football game. He also suggested that she sit in the stands with her boyfriend that's sitting on the sideline. Now, a quick commercial break. Working at ESPN has its perks, but it is all work here. People think ESPN jobs are easy, but it's not easy. We're coming! <laughs> 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 Marco! Pull out! Marco! Pull out! Marco! Pull out! Bill, you got those paperwork ready? Bill! Bill, you got that pit? What are you doing? Dude, smell these markers. This one smells like great. Huh? See, that one smells good. Yeah, oh, smell this one. Smell this one. It's blueberry. Oh, blueberry. blueberry. That one smells good. See, look. Taste that. It's, it's really good. ESPN, it's a hard job. Right now, we're both swamped. Yeah, Stuart, I'm ready to go home. Yeah, let's head up. Hide and seek, 20 minutes, steals it! <laughs> It's your boy, Stuart Scott, coming at you live with an exclusive interview with Coach Goldsmith, head coach at Duke University. First question, what are your thoughts on the incident with Heather Sue Mercer? Well, Stuart, Heather Sue Mercer is a respectful and athletic individual. She's a joy to have in our program, and we love being around her, but we feel she is not qualified enough to be in our Duke program. What is your opinion on girls playing in guy sports? Thank you, Coach Goldsmith, for this interview. Thank you, sir. All right, have a good day. Next on SportsCenter, we have the guys from PTI duking it out about the two big cases here in 1997. Welcome to PTI. It's your boy, Mike Wilpop. And your boy, Tony Kornheiser. We're here today to play the game role play. Role play. And I am going to be Heather Sue Mercer, who is suing Duke University, who, and I am uh, Coach Goldsmith. I will be Mike Tyson.
coming back live at Sports Center. We asked people on the streets what they thought about the Heather Sue Mercer case. Hi, right, we have Brian with us, and we're here to ask him a question. What do you feel about, how do you feel about the Heather Sue Mercer case? I feel that she should be able to be playing on the NCAA team. Do you think she should get $2 million? Uh, depending on her case, I mean, does she have a good lawyer? Uh, I guess good enough, because she did win the case. She did win the case? All right, yeah. well, um, I guess given the everything going on, why not? Alright, All right, we have Josh Shumway with us, and he's here to tell us how he feels about the Heather Sue Mercer case. Do you feel that she should be able to play with men? No, she shouldn't be playing on a man's sport. Why do you feel this way? Because it's a man's sport, not a woman's sport. Do you think she should get the $2 million? Fuck no. <laughs> wow, those are some strong opinions. Those are very strong opinions. One more great opinion is by Judge Foreman on this case. Mercer filed a log a lawsuit against Duke and Goldsmith alleging sex discrimination and the violation of Title IX of the Educational Amendments of 1972 and negligent misinterpretation and breach of contract in violation of North Carolina. Title IX prohibits discrimination on the basis of sex by educational institutions receiving federal funds. Duke that concludes tonight's episodes of Sports Center. Heather Sue Mercer did end up winning the case with $2 million. Have a good night, America. Do you want me to say it? Oh, no, I'll, I'll. <laughs> it's your boy, Stuart Scott. Goldsmith told Mercer not to go. To Goldsmith told Mercer not to go to any summer events, and refused to give her a uniform. Stop. Goldsmith told Mercer not to participate in any summer events, and refused to give her a uniform. <laughs> Goldsmith. <laughs> yeah, this is going on the end. Oh. Just do it like right now without even like, just do it. Right. I, I know you're not doing it because I know it's recording now. Like, <laughs> Shit, I should have turned off. Welcome back to Sports Center. Uh, we're here live. We <laughs> fucked up this already. <laughs> We have John Shumway with us, right? John, Josh. Yeah, Josh Shumway. So we have Josh Shumway with us, and he's here to tell us about his opinion on... What's her name? Sue Mercer. 